What's up y'all, it's your boy Tay the Guy, and in this video we're talking about how the road to 99 works, alright? I'm gonna show you guys how the attribute system works, some of you guys don't even know how that works, some of y'all don't even think you use VC to level up, I don't know what y'all think. We're gonna talk about the rep system, how it's completely gone, and how it's changed. We're gonna talk about unlocks at every single level, and like what, like all the unlocks you get from 70, 75, 80, 85, uh, etc. Alright, we're gonna talk about all that, so make sure you hit that like button for your boy, and if you're new and you hit that sub button, hit that notification button you know we upload multiple videos a day so don't miss a single video hit that notification button hit that bell also we're giving away a copy of 2k18 so all you gotta do is follow my twitter at the bottom of the screen you know what i mean send me a picture of you liking this video and being subscribed tweet it at me don't send it in my dms and um yeah i'll enter you in the giveaway we're pulling that next week all right let's get into this all right y'all so look right here now i'm gonna explain these attributes to y'all i'm gonna explain the attribute system okay Alright, so as you know, the rep system's gone. A lot of people are still confused about this. A lot of people don't even know if you spend VC on attributes, if you have to level up, this or that. How do you get your overall up? Alright, listen. Very simple. See these little white markers right here? These little white arrows? That is the that is the full cap. That is as high as you can get this. This like last, so like for Dunks right here, he has four available upgrades right now, but he could get four more as he plays the game, as he unlocks more attribute upgrades. Just like last year, you have to unlock more upgrades, right? um so yeah that white thing is the is the full cap and then what you have unlocked right now is just as many little arrows as you could um fill up right as you see his primary because he's a point forward sharpshooter or whatever um his his primaries can damn near go to the top one off ball handling one off passing a, a three off speed three off excel right and then he's a sharpshooter secondary so he's two off his max three point uh four or five off his max mid-range right his layups and duck or his layups are pretty high um so yeah you, the caps are pretty good to start um now how this works in terms of your level system so he has like a milli uh, in vc just because like it's he's he's playing at whatever event it was right but how it works is you earn vc and stuff and that obviously puts up your overall now you level up from playing games you could level up from you know, practicing you could level up from any micro games you could level up from in the park pro-am the venue anti whatever right and that earns you level progress as well as vc but um if you just straight up put into your attributes you know what i mean for example he puts in the, he fully puts into everything here everything he can put into he puts into which costs him just under 200k i believe it's 190 and that's what you start with if you order the legend gold right 200k vc i think you get um so yeah you get all that for like 200k and then you go straight up to an 85 overall and as you see he unlocks pretty much everything so i mean that's that's good and bad it's not really bad because it's not really taking away anything i guess it unlocks you more animations earlier but um everything else is just like accessories you just unlock you the, the capabilities do more things right and and more animation stuff so it's not really holding it's not really making anyone uh it's not like a pay to win you know what i mean just because you spend vc you're gonna have a better player obviously but it's not like you unlock anything at higher levels that's gonna make you better other than 99 of course that that gives you them them legend badges but um you can't buy yourself all the way up to 99 obviously you're gonna have to grind at that point because 99 is pretty much like uh, legend 5 or superstar 5 whatever you want to call it right so that's that but what's really good about this is that it's not really a grind no more you know what i mean it's not really like a heavy heavy grind in terms of if you want to make a new guy um so like for example the first dude i make i'm gonna just spend all my vc on him you know what i mean then i'm gonna make a second dude and that's gonna be the dude i grind so right away off the jump i can have two dudes um instead of just having one that you have to grind through no matter what even if you spend all your vc on him you're still going to grind because you got to get your badges and everything as you level up you unlock badges you know what i mean so i mean obviously you don't unlock your key badges as you level up but you do unlock other badges so let's just watch him do this all right so as you see he's going to put into everything max possible um three point mid range so i'm pretty sure he's a, what, a sharp shooting point forward or a, a point forward or a playmaking and ball handling sharpshooter whatever you want to call it he's a small forward though and small forwards are bad this year they nerfed the hell out of small forwards from last year because we all know those 610 freaking Giannis Antantica Pupo, whatever the hell his name is type player builds he yeah that's that was just stupid but I see right here he spent 190k to fully upgrade his dude to 85 overall um and he unlocked the hardened badge because so he went up from 60 to 85 so he's unlocking all the 65 stuff hold up let me let me pull that back and read all this 
pro level dribbling shooting dunking flashy pass animations so flashy pass animations you can unlock just from your overall now you don't need it's not it's not more rep you know what i mean i love flashy passes yeah man you know me i'm a dimer you know what i mean so i'm really happy about that um what else you got the ability to perform pre-game rituals at 65 customize your look the swag's main street clothing selection has been expanded okay uh foot locker has more shoes reach. so this is all 65 so you unlock all that 65 now 70 you get the expressive badge elite level dribbling shooting dunking flashing pa flashy passes um celebrations more hats um tattoos emotional badge wait did i say emotional i'm not even trying to pull that back um at level 75 you create your own jump shot so at, at overall 75 you get your own um, jump shot creator all right 75 you unlock signature emo animations uh, signature movement animations. That's actually kind of a low overall. That's not that bad. Uh, my core customization is now available at level 75. Headband, sleeves, more stuff uh, at 75. The NBA store unlocks at overall 75. JBL headphones at the 2K guys. I don't know why they're they're pushing these these headphones so much. Like I don't know why we're rocking headphones. No, I ain't never seen one rock that. Clutch performer badge at 80 overall. Um, signature pregame, yeah, whatever. That's anything. The GM is taking notes of your play. You oh, okay, so no more because because as you know, there's no more off days, right? So at 80 overall, you could pick what um, jerseys you wear. You get more hats. You have the ability to design and purchase custom T-shirts on the main street. So at 80 overall is when you unlock the custom T-shirt thing, which is the little booth right there where you could download and design. Yeah, as you see, design and purchase custom T-shirts and uh, long sleeve shirts, right? So you unlock that at 80 overall. All right, docs. Um, oh, you unlock you unlock different hair colors at 80 overall. At 85, you get the microwave badge, signature celebration animation, signature movement animations, another GM enabled ability, customize your arena sounds. Oh, okay, that's cool. 85, um, Mitchell and Ness gear at 85. More shoes. Wait, check out the new selection of off the hook shoes at Foot Locker at 85 overall. And as you see, he doesn't touch 90, so we don't get to see. But as you see, even though he unlocked all that stuff, he still doesn't get no progress towards his key badges right here. So as you see, key badges right here on the side. These are, since he is a, uh, what, what is he again? Playmaking sharpshooter or whatever. He's got Lob City Pat. He's got all of his playmaking badges, right? But um, these aren't these aren't Hall of Fame, I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure these are all gold. I'm, I'm like 90% sure that these are all gold. And then to the right, which I don't know if he shows. He doesn't show, but they're the secondary badges. And there's like 20 of those. Or there's a lot of secondary badges, obviously. Um, but yeah, you see skill boost, Gatorade, everything. So yeah, that is that, y'all. So that is how the um, that is how the attribute system stuff works. I think I'm gonna separate this video of me talking about the attributes and stuff from that from the last video. But um, yeah. So make sure y'all just hit that like button for your boy. Don't forget I'm doing an NBA 2K18 giveaway. Um, all you gotta do is follow my Twitter at the bottom of the screen. Send me a screenshot of you liking this picture and being subscribed to me. I'll enter you in that giveaway, and um, we're drawing those winners next week, I believe. Um, yeah, next week before the game comes out. And um, last thing is, uh, hey, if you're new and hit that sub button, hit that notification button as well. Join the notification squad and never miss a video. Thank you for watching. It's your boy Taylor God, and I'm out. Peace. Young nigga, I'm just trying to run through a check Soon as you get a necklace, they be aiming for your neck Half of these men who damn me at it, ain't got no respect And these cats just used to curb me, now they wanna have sex Goddamn, I'm just getting started Fuck with the kid like you're getting carded